Hi everybody, Melissa Avera here. Wanted to give you an update on the real estate market. Um, there's been a lot of changes that have happened um, very recently, some just within the last week. And one of the main things, a lot of you guys have probably heard, and I'm getting a lot of questions about all of these lawsuits that have been happening with the um, settlements with the National Association of Realtors. And pretty much, long story short, the main change that is now taking place is if you are a buyer, um, you and I, you want me to help you purchase a house, I have to have a signed buyer representation agreement um, with you as my client before I can even open a door to a home saying that I represent you and in there saying what my compensation is. Now, however, just because I disclose in there that this is what my compensation is, doesn't mean you're necessarily on the hook for having to pay that. And what I mean is, the biggest thing is forever, it's always been kind of the norm for a seller to pay the both buyer and seller, uh, realtor, broker commissions. And all of that can still be the same. Everything is negotiable. But what they're trying to push for is if a seller only wants to pay their listing agent, they don't have to offer a buyer agency commission. Therefore, in order for that realtor that who's representing the buyer to get paid, they have to have in writing what their fee is, and it has to be, it cannot be open-ended. It has to be very, um, you know, cut and dry. This is what it is. And so say, for example, um, I'm representing you as a buyer and you sign an agreement with me and I find out that the house you want to buy, that that seller is offering, say, a 3% buyer agency commission. Well, if that's the case, then you don't have to pay as the buyer anything to me. Now, if that seller says, yes, I will pay a 2% um, fee and if my rate, say, was 3%, then you would be on the hook as the buyer for 1%. So that's really the big change um, going on. It's just a, a little different way of doing business. Um, you know, so w we will see how everything transpires. You know, not everything, everybody looks at these things as a positive change. And I think um, once the dust settles, it will be probably a good change for the industry um, and for everyone involved. Um, it will make the true pros stand out in the industry and I hope that you guys will always reach out to me and look at me as your trusted real estate advisor. It's always been my goal and always will be my goal to put you in the best financial position I possibly can with um, you know doing a real estate deal with you. So if you guys have questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to me. I am always here to help and I hope I get to see you all very soon. Have an awesome day.